Hello everyone, Phoenix Knight here. Welcome to the channel. As you can see, we've got quite the product unboxing today, so rather than me spend too much time yammering about it, we're going to get right into it and we're going to start with that plastic bag that's partially open. I realize I'm kind of getting nothing but spoilerific here, but I went to one of my local game stores earlier this morning and did some shopping. Several things caught my eye there. And I do have my iPad in shot, and you can see I've got it open to one of the app-based games. But one of the things, because one of the things I've hesitated on for a long time since starting the channel, is putting an app-based game on the channel. So I wanted to do a little bit of testing with that as well. But anyway, this is all stuff from the local game store that I got earlier this morning. So we'll go ahead and grab the box that's partially open here first. And we see that we've got the Starfinder Beginner Box. Now, there's another friend of mine who plays a lot of board games, but is also wanting to start running Starfinder. So I wanted to get the beginner box and check it out for myself, see if I can see if I like it based on a solo adventure. But anyway, we see it's got everything that we need to play the game, so we can put that off to the side. That that solo adventure might hit the channel once I get a little bit more of a feel for the game, but That'll, get, that'll be something for me to sink my teeth into. Anyway, let's go ahead and get into this bag next. And we see that we've got some character packs for Star Wars Imperial Assault. I've got Leia Organa here. Now when I go to the collection, I can check what all I've got here. It's probably not... I might have to zoom in a bit on the app, which is something I... Admittedly, something I've been afraid of as I've pondered getting into these app-based games, but we see here that I already do have Le the Leia Organa Ally Pack, so I'm actually going to put this off to the side. That'll have to go back to the local game store at some point, but probably tomorrow, but anyway. Next Ally Pack here, we say that we've got IG-88. So you can see here it's just a quick description of everything that's in there. More importantly, I can come up to the app find IG-88, and add that I've got it. So that can go to the side of something that'll be going into the collection. The next ally pack up. Actually, this is a villain pack, technically. The Royal Guard Champions from Imperial Assault. So, go ahead and mark that one as well. Step out of here. Next pack up is another villain pack. Where now we've got Maul coming in, into the game. So I can mark that off. Alright, next up, and I think this is the last ally pack that we've got. Or another villain pack. Hired Guns Villain Pack. So this seems like, this part of it seems like a, um, an unboxing that was very focused on villains. And then there's actually one more thing in here that I've been really needing to see as I get into wargaming. Target lock laser line from the Army Painter. So this is supposed to be a laser pointer that can actually generate a line instead of just a point, like you've seen me use countless times on the channel. But I'll go ahead and get this open and we'll give it a quick test. Let's see, that's going to go on a key ring from the looks of it. And, um... I wonder if the battery needs to be flipped in here. And we can take that out. We need... Let's see if that helped anything. Oh, there! Okay. Let me move the iPad out of shot. Yeah, that actually... That looks... That looks slick. That'll do... That'll do exactly what I need it to. I'll probably have to get some spare batteries for this as well, because I can see using this quite a lot. So now I've got so now I've got the classic point laser pointer and a line laser pointer. But anyway, that will do it for the bag from the local game store. That can hit the pin. Now we'll get into unboxings, and we've got all familiar faces on the channel. If you're a regular follower of my channel, then you've seen Dr. Squatch on the channel a few times before, and you also probably know that it's about time for my bi-monthly soap order. So, 
Let's go ahead and see what all we've got in here. As you guys know, I definitely talk about the whole gamer rather than just the rather than just the games themselves. So that's why I'm okay unboxing stuff like this on the channel. Let's make sure we can get the invoice to pull that right out of shot so I don't get surprised by anything here. Okay. And after my last episode with this knife, I'm being very careful about closing it so that I can hit the bin. We'll get the bubble out of shot, and I'm liking the smells coming out of here. So anyway, we've got some deodorant here. We've got Cool Fresh Aloe, Wood Barrel Bourbon, Pine Tar, and Fresh Falls. I'm experimenting with my deodorant a bit more. Anyway, there are those three, along with the Fresh Falls. I actually kind of like the Fresh Falls the best, but I'm willing to experiment with some of these other scents. Speaking of Fresh Falls, I've got two bars of that soap. I went for a lot of sameness in this order. Two bars of Pine Tar. Two of the Cool Fresh Aloe. A bar of Cold Brew Cleanse. And a bar of Summer Citrus. So I'm trying to, so as part of trying to get serious about weight loss, I'm also trying to get more serious about more natural products. But anyway, these can all go back to the box. That will eventually have to move into the bathroom at some point. Anyway, that will do it for this box from Dr. Squatch. Now Amazon is getting ready to dominate the rest of our product unboxing. I know what all is what most of what all is supposed to be in these Amazon boxes, but I'm not sure what's where. So I guess we're going to find out together. Come on, turn that the other way then. Okay. All right, let's see what's in here. Okay, looks like this is an Imperial Assault focused box, so we'll bring the iPad back in with the app. Let me zoom that out just a touch. And the first thing I can get my hands on here, after all the villain packs, we finally actually have an ally pack, Ahsoka Ta Tano, Rebel Instigator. So we can come back to the app, find Ahsoka, and we'll add her there. Then continuing with the Imperial Assault theme, we've got a set of extra dice because making sure I have enough dice is always a good thing. Even though I expect to be mostly playing this game solo, that'll open up playing with friends potentially. And then we have the Tyrant's of Lothal expansion. Now, I do like Grand Admiral Thrawn as a character, so I wanted to pick up his villain pack as well, but I haven't been able to... I do have an order out for it on Amazon, but I haven't gotten shipping yet on when that's supposed to be coming in. But anyway, we can bring the... We can bring that expansion out of shot, but anyway, that's our first Amazon box down. Now let's bring our second one into shot. We're going to keep the app somewhat close here, just because I know there's supposed to be one more Imperial Assault item coming out of this delivery. But like I said, I'm not sure exactly where it is. But let's crack into this next big, pretty big box and find out. <sighs> All right, looks like it is here. But anyway, I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself here. So next up we find the Heart of the Empire expansion. So once again, just continuing to expand the Imperial Assault experience. Heart of the Empire. I'll definitely have to crack everything open before I get another session of that to the table. I will be busy next maintenance night I take on board gaming, but we also see... We also see a game that I liked playing with one of my friends a couple months ago. Hand of Fate Ordeals, the adventure card game of life and death. 
Now this is supposed to be an adventure based deck builder. And like I said, I'd really liked this one, so I wanted to grab it for myself and explore the solo play of that. We can probably bring that out of shot because I don't think there's anything else for Imperial Assault that I'm going to need. So I'll have to see how the app looks on... I'll have to see how the app looks when I go to upload this. Then we've got way too much air in here. That can move out of shot. And then our last item that I see in here, let me make sure there's nothing else. Okay. And an uneventful, but typically important, delivery of sleeves. So, as you guys know, I go through a lot of sleeves in... with my board game collection. I sleeve... I sleeve as much as I can. I have to have a hell of a reason to not want to sleeve a game, but... not just me randomly using, but anyway. We've got one more Amazon box here, so let's go ahead and get that cracked open. This last box I'm expecting to be more lighting based on process of elimination. So as you might have noticed in some of my last and some of my recent videos, I've been having some fun in games with my lighting, deciding it wants to shut off at random times. So hopefully we can put a stop to that. But anyway, let's go ahead and crack this open and see what it is. We've got boxes inside of boxes. Oh, this is going to be delightful, but sure enough, based on what I'm seeing on the label, I can get that box out of the way. Once again, being careful as I close the knife, just after my last history with it. The last time I used it on camera. Um, I don't know. Okay, here we go. We see that sure enough, and I'm not going to crack it open too much further, but we do have my new set of lighting. So, yeah, this will just give me more... I think this will give me another set of lights, remotes, tripods, which I did not much like the tripods that came with these lights, and the remotes as well. So, another good product unboxing, which gave me a lot of useful stuff. But anyway, that will do it for this product unboxing. Tomorrow, we're all set to continue the fall campaign for Arkham Horror, the, the, not the fall campaign, the winter campaign for Arkham Horror, the card game, with the second scenario, To the Forbidden Peaks. Then Wednesday, we'll have the, we'll step back into the Twilight Imperium universe as we play Twilight Inscription. Thank you for watching the video. Please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Be sure to turn on notifications so you get my content. Be well, stay safe, take care of yourselves and your loved ones, and I'll be back with more videos in the future. Until then, take care, everyone.